Hey, what's going on? My name is Cameron, um, and I'm opening this jersey here. I've not opened it. I just kind of cut it open. I have not looked inside yet, and I'm kind of expecting the worst, and I'm going to do a bit of a rant. Um, if you want, you can go ahead and skip ahead. I'll probably put the time where I actually open the jersey uh, listed so you can skip ahead if you want, but uh, I'm kind of expecting the worst here because I didn't realize before I bought this jersey that uh, you know I had done some research on AliExpress or AliExpress, which is the website I picked this up at. I had done some research and watched some videos online, and I was like, man, you know, those quality jerseys are actually phenomenal, you know, and that's kind of why I went with the website. Um, you know, obviously, this is a Chinese uh, jersey selling website, uh, and this jersey was $27, free shipping from China. It took a couple weeks to get here, but that's, uh, you know, that's a given. But I had done some research and saw some jerseys that looked phenomenal. I was like, that's great, you know, so I went on there and picked up a jersey. What I didn't realize is that this website is actually kind of like uh, eBay in a way it's not in like eBay in that you're, you're bidding on the jerseys it's like eBay because you uh, there, there's multiple vendors and I didn't know that ahead of time I just assumed this website's good so I ordered from the website without doing research on the specific vendor and with this vendor they just basically took a picture from the Bills website and that was the picture on there so it wasn't an actual picture of their quality of the jersey so I'm kind of expecting the worst here because I've seen other ones on there where they don't even have the Nike patch in the front uh, things like that. And actually, before I get too ahead of myself here, before you, I guess, you want to hate or whatnot, um, let me just go ahead. I have this I have this Kiko jersey that I bought already. I spent $100 on it, and it's an official jersey. So I know, you know, I'm buying from China here, but, uh, you know, I figured I'd give it a shot. $27 free shipping, and if I can get a de another decent jersey to add to my collection, uh, you know, why not? I know I'm not supporting the bills, things like that, but I have, you know, obviously bought this jersey uh, from them. So, but let's go into it. Let's see here um, what kind of quality we're actually looking at with this jersey here. But just to clarify, though, if this jersey is bad, um, just keep in mind I do know that they do have um, good jerseys. But let's see what this one's looking like here. And I am seeing a good sign to start off, though. I'm seeing the NFL logo. Um, let me just get this open. Okay. So, compared to the other pictures that I've seen of other jerseys, this one actually is looking pretty good, though. Um, and one other thing that I was kind of worried about was the fact that uh, this player was so new to the team that they I thought they probably would have, you know, just kind of forced out a, a jersey real quick just to get them out. But this is actually looking very good. I mean, the letters are a little shiny, if you see, which is obviously not a good sign because, uh, you know, legit jerseys are not that shiny. Um, but, you know, for the money, fly wires looking good. NFL jersey is rubber, or the NFL logo is rubber. If you look, though, if we can get on the stitching here, focus. The stitching is very out of whack, very crazy, compared to um, the official jersey here, which doesn't, you can't even see the stitching. If I can get a focus on that, uh, you know, in comparison to that, that stitching is obviously substantially better than this. But, I mean, for the money, $27, I'll take some of these flaws with it. Um, but let's get a... Let me just get a shot of the whole jersey all together here. If it'll focus. This is what we're looking at here. I mean, you're looking at the material down here. Um, this material obviously does not have the mesh because this isn't the Elite. This is just the simple game jersey. Um, but this, it's got the mesh down here. The jock tag looks like it's a little high. A little high in comparison if you're looking at this. You know, it's obviously right there. A little high, but I don't think it's anything anybody... Uh, would notice it does have a nice sheen to it which is good um but everything's stitched down here except for the jersey uh or the, the the sleeves and if you're looking here you got a little stray coloring here um but these types of things uh, i'm just gonna t I, just, I i came into this mindset without even expecting this to have this i expected um you know it was the other jerseys i saw on the website there was no flyway it was just a solid material here the the collar looked absolutely terrible Oh, this collar is actually very nice. It's stretchy material. Um, it's actually even better than my game jersey, I think. Um, but let's flip it over here. Um, very, very nice Bills logo here. Look at that. It's phenomenal. Um, the Watkins. Um, no stitching between the letters. Very, very impressed with this jersey, actually, for the price especially. Uh, you know, again, the, the, the letters are, are shiny, but for the price, $27 free shipping, this is a... A stellar a stellar jersey I'll get it down there on the materials again so you can kind of see them um, this material is a lot lighter if you want to compare here actually let me just take the jersey off so I can compare uh, the two 
Um, keeping in mind this is an authentic or our elite replica as opposed to this game jersey. So you're going to see some differences because of that. I apologize for keeping it black there for a little while. Um, but uh, substantially darker. Mine is substantially darker if you're comparing here. Um, but I mean, when you're not comparing, I wouldn't really notice to be honest with you. Um, let me flip this Kiko jersey over again. So I mean, you're looking at the backs. I, I'm substan I am su really surprised by the quality of this Watkins jersey, to be honest with you. I was not expecting it to be this good. I mean, you got a couple random things like this straight thing I'll have to cut off. But, uh, you know, the Nike logo is stitched on there. If you're looking at it, I mean, obviously it's folded in half because it was in a in that e-packet there, as they call it. Um, but let's get it stretched out. You know, it's stitched on there. Letters are all stitched on there. Um, you know, you're seeing this stray. Just kind of got to go down through there and snip off the excess. But uh, I mean, for $27 free shipping, you're not going to get much better than this. So I, I, I strongly urge everybody to go check out, you know, AliExpress. Um, I've seen it's very good. Oh, yeah, let's look at this here, too. Uh, you know, this one has some connected stitching, as you can see. But uh, from a distance, you don't really notice that. Um, and then if you want to look at the tags, I mean, it's just got the one tag and, you know, where you put the UPC. Flipping it over, it's got this absolutely, well, I mean, it's got the NFL logo, but it does not look that that good. But that might be how it is on the tags, I'm not too certain. Um, but there's where they would put the uh, the hologram, stating, you know, it's authentic or whatnot. But, uh, but yeah, very, very pleasantly surprised by how this, this jersey turned out. And uh, relieved, because once I saw the other ones on there and the actual actual pictures of the jerseys um, had me very concerned because they were absolutely terrible quality but uh very happy with this one uh, but thanks for checking it out guys um, and just to compare the front here before I let myself go here there's the, the fronts in comparison I mean like I said a little lighter and this is of course the elite so it's got the different jersey it's got the mesh starting below the letters and things like that which is how the elites are um, but you know aside from the color being off and as I said you know I wouldn't really even notice that if I did, wasn't comparing it to an authentic jersey. And I mean, who's to say I've never, I've never owned an actual elite jersey. You know, colors might be different, but I'm, I'm guessing elites um, from the actual Bills store would be probably about the same color as the game jerseys. Um, but as you can see, the jock tag is a little high. Um, let's go through here, actually, just to make sure you know if there's anything in particular you guys are looking for. I want to make sure I can kind of cover it. Um, but here's the two. This is the authentic game jersey, and then this is the elite. Uh, you know, Chinese copy. Um, that's the only real, I guess, downside is I'm seeing that stitching is a little wild uh, in comparison. But uh, it's just one of those things you got to kind of take take with it with the price. You know, you're getting it for probably a tenth because the elite jerseys are typically around 250. So you're getting it for about a tenth of the price. So you know, you can get 10 of these jerseys for the price of one elite uh, authentic. So and then let's look at this. You know, it's actually got the the serial number it says made in Honduras, but obviously this is made in China. Uh, but there's the, the Bills logo. As you can see, one of them is off whack. I'm guessing probably this tag is uh, you know not centered because you're comparing it to this Bills logo. Obviously, one of them is off kilter. Uh, I don't believe it's the Bills logo. I believe it's this tag that's off center, so um, you probably wouldn't see it. Um, actually, let's compare that real quick. Somebody who got an un, uh, a Kiko jersey off this website, um, they did say that the name on the back was a little off center. I just want to kind of compare that real quick. Um, it looks like it might be a little bit off center if you're looking at it, but I mean, I'm sitting here studying it. And I'm trying to, it looks like it might be a little to the left, but um, I mean, would not be noticeable in my eyes. And I'm barely, I'm looking at it right now. I'm not really noticing it that much. Um, but the Bills logo looks centered, things like that. So thanks for checking out the video. Uh, I'm very pleasantly surprised and I urge you to go check out um, AliExpress, whatever team you're into, they probably got your jerseys. They got Pro Bowl jerseys on there. I think I'll get myself a uh, Mario Williams Pro Bowl jersey off the website because it looks pretty sick. I don't believe, I don't know if that one's stitched or not though, but thanks for checking out the video. Uh, take it easy.